That's what he needs to do when there's two of them in there. Dan, we're ready. Ah! Woo! Hold on! Give me it up, Jack! We are here with a group from Zach's Inc. We're doing Corporate Sport Training's Spuds of Thunder event. We've got 140 people in this room. They are building castles or citadels to protect themselves from the bombardment of the barbarian hordes. So these, these are gonna be, these are gonna be the projectiles, the ammunition. Look around the room, everybody's doing stuff. Right now they're earning extra material for their fortresses. So we'll see how they all do a little later. Take him. We're initially we're hanging. Yeah. Oh. Barbarian hordes who are coming. And they're clearing out our fields. Worse still, they're using our very own potatoes to batter down the gates of our city and try and take our precious goods. They're trying to take our food. They're trying to take our treasure. They're trying to take our wine. Oh, no. no. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that breeze feels good. No. Woo! Straight through the glass. Yeah, Angie? Yeah. Angie? Yeah. That was mine. We need you to come to our rescue. What we need is a design for a castle, a fortress, a citadel. We need a castle, a fortress, a citadel that is capable of withstanding withering bombardment by the barbarian hordes with potatoes. Nicely done. Oh, nice Each of you on the table will find a package with a castle, a very fine looking fortress in the front of it. This is inspiration. <laughs> Too low. Are you excited about your new tattoo? All right. <laughs> I think, is he at a thousand? <laughs> what are you working on? Me? Yeah. Cutting out the crown. Is that, oh, it's perfect. Look at that. I know, it's right? getting there. Very nice. <laughs> He's a leader. He's a leader of men. Are you, and, some, and some women. I see a wedding ring. You is your wife going to be excited about this tattoo? <laughs> we'll have to post it, you know. I'll have to, I'll have to take a picture of Do you have kids? Yeah. Oh. My son's got two. Oh, so there you go. Left that I know of. You I don't can, know. You're going to go show this off? <laughs> I, hey, I got a 22 and an 18 year old. I'm an old guy. <laughs> but you get to go show off a tattoo I now. I didn't have any tattoos until I came to Zaxby's Leadership Conference in 2014. I mean, like, uh, this is what I've always wanted my whole life. What's the bar bar tattoo? Yeah. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. Awesome. I would like you to create the most ferocious potato projectile, like a little potato monster. On video. What sound does it make? <laughs> oh, much better. <laughs> oh, look at this one. What sound does that make? Collect <laughs> your fragile items. This is the treasure of the land. Now, we can all agree the potatoes might actually be the most awesome thing ever created. And because they are so awesome, what I'm looking for right now is I need seven poets who are willing to compose a ballad called Ode to the Potato. First seven poets I have up here will participate. One, two, three. Hello. Silence to Robert. He is the poet from team number five. He will be presenting his version of Ode to the Spud. So continue working, but appreciate his work. Ode to the Spud. Boiled, broiled, baked or fried. The beauty almost makes me cry. The smooth, rough skin and endless eyes you see into my soul I can't hide. 
My love for you, so pure, so true. Potato, how I love you. Put your hands together for Robert. That was beautiful. Good to the potato. Be it mashed, be it twice baked, steamed or fried, your deliciousness cannot be denied. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's never happened before. Frank has rhymed. Play-Doh with Sharknado. That is a first. <laughs> Tell me about your design. We have... I've got a shelf on the inside that can hold up to about probably 15 pounds. Okay. Ah, oh, look at that. Nice. We've had some alarming news. We have some scouts in the field. We've discovered a barbarian fortress. These are the very same barbarians who have been bombarding our castles and we found a weapon stash. Do you guys see what we have over here? Yes! <laughs> Anybody familiar with what these might be? Yeah. This technology cannot be allowed outside of the Potato Kingdom. I'm gonna demonstrate exactly what we're dealing with here so you understand the firepower of these barbarians. We are going to, a little bit later, have an opportunity to demonstrate exactly what these will do. So what I need you to do, I need, let's say one volunteer, you right here, come on forward. And I need everybody else to part the sea, part the sea. The very latest barbarian potato technology. I'm gonna load it rather than with a potato because that would be dangerous in here. I'm gonna load it with a bag of a potato. Oh. Oh. Trust me, the barbarians are not using bags. <laughs> right. This is gonna be just to demonstrate what's going on on the outside of our castle. Man, that is a little tight. Ooh. If you could put this under your arm. Okay. <laughs> hold, it, hold it back. There's a trigger on this, and I really mean it. You need to open up. Clear up, guys. Clear, clear, clear. Stand back. Get the castle. When you, and you will, you will each be firing these, and guess what the targets may be. When you, when you fire these, this button on top is the trigger. When you push the trigger, it will ignite the, the mixture, which is very flammable. Dennis and I are the only two who will charge a cannon. So this is how it's going to work. You're going to come up, you're going to hold it like this. We're going to spray. This is what the waiver was for. We're going to put this on, and then you are going to shoot at your discretion. Point it and make sure. <laughs> this is what you are dealing with. You've got five minutes to put your castles together. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Who believes in their castle? Yeah, <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh yeah. They meet in the center. No, no, no. No, no, On the table. Come back behind this location right here. Leave the cannons right where the cones are. Castles on the table, castles in the front, people back here. Let's go. Uh. <laughs> All right, when you are ready. You are ready. clear. Here we go. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 That's a little high. Here we go. What a guy. Woo! 
Bebe. shoot the potato cannon or were you like yes I'm definitely gonna do that I knew I had to do it because I have to tell my kids I shot a potato cannon okay and how did it how was it was it better than you thought it would be yes definitely <laughs> what 